Tesla is starting to build a new factory in the city of Markham. This was announced by the mayor of Markham. Tesla has a track record of having the mayors announcing smaller construction projects before Tesla does. Tesla usually focuses on keeping investors posted for larger projects like gigafactories, and sometimes neglects publicly announcing the construction of smaller factories who might be asking why Tesla is not making this factory in Giga Austin. Well, it's because the Hyper team which is now the Tesla team is based in Toronto, Canada. This might also be a great way to capture some engineering talent that resides in Toronto, although this was most likely not a significant factor. You might also be asking what Hyper Systems is. Well, Hyper Systems is a Tesla company bought around October 2019. Hyper Systems used to manufacture liquid dispensing systems before they were bought by Tesla. Tesla bought this business because of their battery manufacturing technology and is creating a new larger factory a few minutes away from where the first factory is. Tesla will manufacture the machine that manufactures the machine here. All Tesla investors know the importance of the machine that makes the machine. Why does this matter? It actually matters a lot. We all know Tesla is supply constrained. Tesla is avoiding making vehicles like the Tesla Semi and Tesla Van because of how supply constrained they are. Tesla is buying batteries from everyone and telling other battery manufacturers they need more batteries. Batteries are probably the largest issue when it comes to the supply shortage of Teslas. This is why this factory matters. It will help solve Tesla's supply shortage of batteries which the world desperately needs. The world needs a lot of batteries in the coming future. In conclusion, Tesla intends to manufacture battery manufacturing equipment and test the battery manufacturing equipment at the Markham factory. This factory will help solve the battery supply problem for Tesla. This is just my personal opinion and not financial advice. Thanks for watching. If this video added value to your life, consider subscribing.